if Dallas doesn't play, if Romo doesn't play like a complete tool, the Cowboys blow the Giants out. Four turnovers, three interceptions by Romo. The Giants get 24 points off of that. Giants fans, you had the better quarterback today. I got to give him props. Eli was ripping us apart. Steve Smith and Mario Manningham, looks like you got some pretty good pickups. Those young guys are going to be good for y'all for a while. Dallas, your running game was legit. This man right here, he did have a fumble. Can't have that, but he made up for it. Barber went off. Tashard had his runs. Great stuff. Defense, you pretty much, you know, especially in the first half, shut down the, the running game for the Giants. Uh, second half, they kind of got going, but we blew them away running game-wise in the second half. Over at 170, 175 yards of rushing in the second half by itself, 88 in first. For all the good things Romo does, he makes some of the worst passes. And the first one was just bad. The second one, was it a fluke? Yeah. But it was behind him. It was a bad throw. It was thrown where something fluky could happen. And that's a great job by Kenny Phillips. Being, you know, not giving up on a play. Ball fell right into his hands, but he had the presence of mind taking the end zone. They didn't give him the touchdown, but, you know, they scored anyways. Um, and then the one down deep where uh, I think it was Phillips again, I can't remember, uh, was playing deep safety. Rome didn't even see him. Threw it way over Miles Austin's head, right pick. And it, it killed. It was a good drive and just killed it. And we outplayed the Giants as a team. But we keep making these mistakes. The quarterback keeps making these mistakes. You're going to lose to bad teams. And the Giants don't need your help. Um, so, yeah, this is the time, I guess, to load up on Roma. And there's going to be games down the road. Do I still think she should be the starter? Yeah. Though, if someone better comes along, shoot. Put him in. Um, I think he can get the job. I still, I mean, it's hard right now because that crab. Um, at the same time, on defense, Eli Manning was destroying us. He ripped us apart all game. Uh, Harley could get pressure on him, so the offensive line for them did a good job. I thought our offensive line did a great job as well. Uh, both pass rushes really weren't effective that much. But Eli was able to get away from stuff and make accurate throws. Romo would get away from stuff and make piss poor throws. Uh, you know, and we, even with all those mistakes, all those mistakes, we were still able to take a lead with about three minutes, a little over three minutes left in the game. And then Eli just went Super Bowl on our tails, went right down the field, took off all the time on the clock. Tynes kicks two field goals because he iced him once. The, the second one looked better than the first one did. The first one, he almost missed it. And then right down the middle. If Dallas wants to get back to the playoffs, because we're not talking about championships, she went. Yeah, I mean, we, we, we showed tonight that we're a good football team, that we are, that we're not some scrub team that's just not going to win the games. But in our division against the team who's probably going to win it unless we step it up. You had them at our house opening the new stadium. Looks great, Jerry. Did a great job. You you can't make that many mistakes. So, yeah, I think Dallas outplayed the New York Giants. But the Giants outsmarted and were able to take better opportunities than Dallas did. Because you know how many times they turned the ball over? The Giants? Zilch. Dallas, four. Three interceptions by horrible passes by Tony Romo. Get it together. All the CNS guys at the game know you had a great time before it. And uh, sorry that that had to happen. Um, I mean, it was a great, great football game for people who weren't fans of either team. I know Giants fans loved it, but uh, it's hard to enjoy one when you let it get away like that. Congrats to the New York Giants and all the fans. Championship teams are opportunistic, and Dallas wasn't.